I mean, that's a very long story. I don't know, but I can say that I had the opportunity to have exposure in my life of ups and downs, of various different business, going through the different cycles, business cycles. Which, if I go back to my olden days, yes, I feel that. I don't think any MBAs or any business person gets this kind of exposure, like what all I have got, and I got the practical exposure. Now that you're out, you say that you can resolve the entire crisis of confidence in the market, restore monies to the people who have lost it, and build back things to the old standing. I think there is again a little. Uh, misinformation i i am not that capable in this i i want to remove this i part of it but i am quite conscious from day one that we don't want to make anybody to suffer because of our non payment we any anybody anybody is due especially any bank will not suffer any money at least on harshad mehta's account i had put in lot of efforts I have put in efforts to, to call on the banks. I had put in efforts to write letters to FM, to RBI governor. And all the while, I've been saying, probably this may be one of the most unique case that uh, on one side such a huge uh, outstanding is there, and there is not a single claimant coming up. Even custodian hasn't got a single uh, claim against Harshad Mehta. Then I am just to ask, what, where is the case? What's the question? and nhb fighting with greenlay state bank fighting with greenlay and uh, nhb i am saying baba you are fighting for me i am here i am prepared to come forward you just work out just spare your person and uh, let's sit together we don't know you straight this has been the answer and it was so shocking so probably <laughs> maybe you owe nobody no money uh no I, I will like you to. I beg your pardon. I said maybe you owe nobody no money. That's a great situation. <laughs> But uh, I am more concerned. This probably beyond few crores. I don't need money. And uh, it it becomes uh, it starts giving you negative effect than the positive. I don't want to pass on that poison to my son. Have your family taken it? Before Already, we are uh, having one, uh, two views. I was on the one side of uh, having so much of uh, ambitious plans, and the other side, my family has always been saying, oh, "What all and why all?" So this gave them the reason that, but. they all has i mean this has been the opportunity again we call it the calamity converted into opportunity and i am seeing a point in there saying something and they are also seeing some point in my see we have been able to resolve there is a ground swell of opinion that maybe you have been discriminated against what do you feel about that we have written a letter to jpc as i feel that Well, the JPC is one uh, forum which can uh, act on what all discrimination has been brought out to. First discrimination is that in nobody's case, the whole family is notified. Virtually today, I am uh, left without any asset or any money, even for my brother's uh, operation, which I requested to get thirty thousand sanction for the operation expenses. i was denied of that that's on one side the number of cases filed against me in every case it is just one fi but in my cases there are seven fi's been filed by different different agencies in case of uh, my membership my not only my membership has been taken up but my family and my brother's membership at stock exchange or uh, my wife's membership also has been taken up it has been suspended they are suspended as a member number of agencies going after me 
it was not in the income tax slapping a huge uh, ridiculous uh, amount of 10000 crore and odd as income tax could that that will help me to be getting one of a noted person in guinness book of record having the highest tax uh, liability on so this all leads to leads me to think on that yes i am discriminated not in one case not in once once if one area is there it can be a chance but not all in other words other people have got away scot free i you got more than your sorry and um, punishment due i won't say that they have got scot free but i will say this way that i am being penalized more than what i should be how does it feel to be free after 111 days it took me quite some time to get back to normal because in this 111 days it happened so many times every time when i was going to the court i was just under impression that ki bhi aaj chhut jaunga ya agle tarikh ko chhut jaunga and it was even uh, justice varya was once mentioned that this is the last time then that was ending on uh, 30th uh, Ju- it was 30th june par har waqt yehi aata gaya pata nahi kahan se kya ho raha hai something coming up again and at one point of time there were two or three agencies waiting to pounce on me as if i was something a commodity very scarce commodity so that made me lately to feel that as if i am going to take quite a long time before coming out and the day when i heard this his verdict doc, uh, justice do that uh, verdict i was not ready to believe it i asked my lawyer are you sure is there anybody waiting or anything else is hanging because again after his verdict it took one day for vaikala jail to release me they were also not sure what to do they were so much habitual of me they was not wanting to allow me so be a free public man. hero to public villain number 1 to back to being public hero it been several swings up and down how do you cope with your current reincarnation as public hero only one and one my request is i don't want bookies don't give me brick pens it's too much of a swing from top to the bottom again bringing it back and i won't say that i am hero let me be what i am and i am proud of what i am that's all you turn out to be a scapegoat in this whole scam as they call it i just don't feel only i have tried to even bring out in a very detailed manner expressing how i am being victimized victimized how things are being discriminated against me like with other players only uh, first of all the big gap is that this whole scam or whatever you call irregularities has been not committed by any one person or any one group of persons it is the whole business lately it came out that yes it has been the system of the market and 80% of the trading volume has been going going beyond the rbi regulations and to the surprise even now the confession is there from the rbi that they were aware of it since last uh, more than a year so if they couldn't change it banks who were the deciding uh, authority who were the one who had the uh, more of a say in the market brokers are the small uh, segment of the whole market you stirred a honest nest by referring to city bank's involvement in the scam for which they've threatened to sue you i'm told i don't know, i haven't received any official uh, communication from them but that was some somebody just now was mentioning that a newspaper is carrying a story there in delhi that they plan to sue me fine before that let them plan let them sue janki raman committee report and janki ram committee let them answer that you feel that the media has been fair to you or unfair i will put it this way that media has been reacting extremes all the time and uh, virtually i can say that nobody has understood exactly what all has happened 
and everybody has tried to explain the situation in their own fashion and so much has come that if i read all the news then i also will get confused of what exactly has happened so i don't know what happens to the common man who has just been fed with so many information and so many um, misinformations what do you think put into an absolute nutshell actually happened what went wrong i think today i am not in a position to talk this as matter is subsidized and it will be adding to more of confusion because now the fact no, won't remain as fact with the background what all has been created so better let me reserve my part of the view on that what do you see as the future of the stock market of the indian stock market that is i had been saying and i i'm still very firm about it that india is a turn around stock on the global exchange and it has all the signs the uh, asian tiger is coming out of the cage it's only a matter i will not suggest for the speculators or short term trader i had always been talking about investors and investors if you go on even averaging out on index basis also has made substantial money forget about the specialization and specialized approach and it's not my view only by the time already now like uh, morgan stanley has already declared that how india is potential and uh, i being a creature of this market and what close with so much of a uh, closeness i have been able to see this market i feel we have one of the greatest potential market why did the stock market not uh, suddenly welcome you out with open arms as one had expected them to they have become more sensible i mean harshad mehta out or in has got nothing to do with stock prices I mean, you can't overreact. They know that if I have a, if I am in a position to buy or sell shares, I can do it being in, behind the bars. And if I am not, I am not able to do it outside because I am still right now bound by so many regulations and systems and environment. So, when do you hope to get back to business? Uh, what do you see as the key shares of the future? frankly speaking i am uh, really out of touch for last four and a half months five months so i don't want to talk anything uh, in particular But without the shares that you backed you had backed certain shares do you see still see them as key players in the market i think i don't uh, see any change in the potentials of those shares it only depends that how things are shaping up now and especially i will not like to again uh, i will reemphasize that i don't want to talk on short term short term market has got into quite a lot of shocks and let the market get absorbed let the market get uh, uh, adjusted to the newer situation but otherwise i see the delay whatever is taking place on the liberalization or the process is the only delay for the stock market to no? if you were to name the five stocks which are the stocks of the future not the short term future but sheer investing future what would you do which are the five that you would mr think nandi of? you can't get that five stocks out of me so easily you have to pay the price for it uh what is the price stock itself okay uh city bank what do you see as uh the future of this interface or the future of this confrontation between you and city bank i won't say i had uh, picked up any confrontation as such i was trying to just uh, give out the facts because nobody has been able to bring out except uh, at two three places some journalists have brought it out and uh, it becomes uh, again if i am made to state the fact i have to give the fact what all is the fact in the market and uh, if i can help as i has always been saying that i am wanting to help the investigating agencies to earth unearth the truth and that is going to exonerate me from the charges which has been levied and this is one of the basic fact so that's what i am doing it what was the interrogation like what were your what were the quizzing days like with the cbi and other investigating agencies especially uh, my experience at cbi was 
very tough because in the history of CBI itself, I don't think anybody has undergone so much of uh, so lengthy interrogations. They claim I that I have a record, the number of hours, number of people. How many? It must have gone beyond 65 people. 65, 70 people interrogating you. 65, 70 people interrogating you at different, different times with different influences, different methods, different style. Everybody has their own style and they claim that yes, everybody is capable of bringing out the information. And they were all uh, being uh, li like there was a competition going on that who gets the information first. You can imagine and I was on the other side of it. But they rough with you. I won't say they rough, rather they approach us more to build up a mental pressure. But that itself is terrible. Mental pressure you, how can you stand that? So number of pages has gone beyond uh, 500 pages in probation. Number of hours must also be 500 to 600 hours. Number of people, 65, 70 people. And number of days, I don't need to tell you. So you've been providing employment to our investigating agencies. No, at the end I was thinking if there is any self-employment scheme, I, I can be a good interrogator myself <laughs> after undergoing so much of uh, 